Hello guys, um, this is Dave from Beta Knowledge. Um, I have been trying to get this BC uh, Broadcam chipset, which is a uh, Wi-Fi chipset, um, to work in Kali Linux. I have been trying to get this work since uh, one month. I have been trying to get it like um, day and day, but um, finally I have got it work. Like you can see here, Wi-Fi Wi-Fi is working fine, and uh, I'll show you my chipset also. See uh, BCM four three one four two, and um, to make it work, we have to do some commands. Actually, I make I'll make it simple for you. I'll just give you two executable files like that sh files. All you have to do is just run them and just restart your system, and your system will get it like um, automatically. Your Wi-Fi will show, and I'll give you. Those uh, links to get the uh, download links for in the description, and uh, all you got to do is just download them. So you can see here, I just pasted this guy, this here, and um, uh, you had to make uh, first you had to run that Kali dash update that sh. First you had to make it uh, change the permission. To change the permission, type ch mode space plus x space that name Kali does update that sh and uh, you can see here this is showing and uh, to run it dot slash backslash slash Kali dash it's update and that will ask for a uh, password just enter the password and uh, actually I have done it and just canceling it and you have to run that another file and we have to change permission for that file also ch mode space plus x is broadcam and um, one second okay and um, one more thing is um, after doing those commands like uh, the first one I said you know Kali dash update dot sh after doing make sure you uh, type this one you name dash r if you were uh, this thing 4.8.0 is there you are um, use uh, like um, version Kali version 4.8.0 make sure if it is 4.8.0 because it is the latest version in this latest version they have uh, made some changes to broadcam 43142 driver chipset okay thank you okay and uh, mm, to run that file i have to mm, get into get the root access first to get the root access type sudo space su type your password actually it is not asking because i have entered it already and um, <coughs> go to that file and uh, ch uh, actually you have to change the permission I see it's mode space plus x space broadcom uh, that file name and um, run that one dot backslash broadcom yeah it will run I'm just cancelling it because I have run it already and it will create a broadcom folder here and finally type restart and that will restart your laptop or computer pc thank you for watching and if you find any difficulty or problem regarding this one please comment below thank you